January 31st at the Los Angeles Staples Center, Technicolor demonstrated a full production HDR broadcast of a game between the Los Angeles Lakers and the Denver Nuggets. Roy Stewart, Vice President of Technology Licensing and Strategic Partnerships, was on site to oversee this landmark HDR broadcast. In a very, very close game, uh, the Lakers won, so that was great. Kind of added to the excitement of the event. Uh, the partners that were involved were Spectrum Sports, uh, which is uh, uh, the regional sports broadcaster here in Los Angeles. At a strategic level, we're trying to accelerate the adoption of HDR. So we built a really good partnership with Spectrum Sports. So we wanted to validate that we could do a full production of, of a game the way it's done today, uh, which is using a, a truck, a vendor, and uh, multiple cameras, multiple inputs for graphics and for score boxes, uh, remote cameras, uh, overhead cameras, uh, POV cameras, etc. And we wanted to produce an event in high dynamic range video. And at the same point in time, we wanted to uh, be able to output uh, a REC 709 or, or standard dynamic range video, which obviously feeds the world that we live in today. So everybody in the industry has been talking about HDR, and there's been a lot of uh, experiments where people have gone in with HDR cameras, but nobody's done a full production the way sports is produced today. So that's what the objective of this event was. It was basically to validate that we could do it, validate that we could do it with existing equipment, um, and uh, validate that we could do both HDR and SDR at the same time, and we could do it with very little capital um, uh, cost, if any, and very little incremental cost.